What if there was a way to have a guaranteed profit in sports betting? Well, guess what guys? That's what this video is gonna be about. We have found a strategy to make a guaranteed profit in sports betting day in and day out. What this strategy entails is not just betting one side or one total, it's betting both sides and finding profit within betting both teams. You win and you profit guaranteed no matter what. Now, let's go up to the whiteboard and we're gonna discuss this strategy in detail. And I'm gonna tell you guys step-by-step step how you're gonna turn a profit day in and day out, month in and month out, no worry on who wins the team or if a total goes over, under, or if a prop bet hits or not. No matter what happens, you're still gonna profit. Let's get right into it. Exactly, how to get a guaranteed profit. You guys have probably heard of this before. It's called arbitrage betting. What it means is that you're betting both sides. That means, for an example, in baseball, let's say the Giants are going against the Dodgers. That means that we're betting the Giants and we're betting the Dodgers. Now, when it goes to the total, it's the same thing. If you're betting over under, it means you're betting the over, let's say nine runs, and you're betting the under nine runs. Now, what you're trying to find is value in the lines to be able to bet on both sides so you ensure a profit so you win no matter what obviously if you're taking both sides the problem with arbitrage betting in the past it takes so long to be able to go through all these sports betting sites and you're able to you know have them link up to where you can bet one side on one sports book and on the other it just it was time consuming and before online sports books it was nearly impossible to do because you'd have to physically go into the sports books and how are you gonna physically all day go into all these different sports books and try to find different lines? So we have found a company that has made it completely 100% easy and hassle-free for you guys to be able to do this and ensure a profit every single day. Before we get to that though, I do wanna go behind me and talk about step one of what you're gonna to need to do before you even get involved in any of this. All right, now let's jump over to the board now and I'm gonna to explain to you guys step one of this process. What bankroll do I use? So when it comes to arbitrage betting, you can can ensure a profit but you need a bankroll obviously we need to look at this a thousand dollar bankroll you can get 200 to 300 dollars profit no hassle with a five thousand dollar bankroll you'll be getting 700 to 1200 dollars a month in profit now with a ten thousand dollar bankroll you'll be getting anywhere from 1500 to 2500 a month that's the first step we need to figure out what type of money we're working with in our bankroll make sure you guys are assessing your bankroll and you know exactly how much you can use in order to do arbitrage betting now let's jump into the laptop guys and I'm going to show you exactly what this website is. So this website is called Odds Jam. Remember that name, Odds Jam. First thing I need to address before we go any further in this. If you go and scroll all the way to the right here, you'll see a state. Now, if you click that highlighted state, you'll see a list of states. Now, these are the states where you're going to have access to be able to do this at. Obviously, not every single state is up here yet. It will be, you know, in the future. But as of right now, these are where you can access these arbitrage bets and you'll have access to all these sports books at. Now, let's get further into this and let's just look at not arbitration or anything like that let's look at the website and how it looks so when you go here this is an MLB section you can go under odds they have all the sports here for all the odds now here's what the benefit of this is right off the bat let's just go to the first match up here and let's say the Seattle Mariners going against the Texas Rangers now if we click on this right here you get to see all these sports books and you're able to see exactly the lines at every single sports book this is just for the money line play now why do you need this guys if you guys have paid attention to anything I've told you in other videos you know you need to have access to multiple sports books you go to pinnacle right here you can see obviously the lowest number we found is minus 212 so that is obviously what you need let's just go down the line a little more here fox bet has at minus 250 why would you take a bet at minus 250 when you can get it at minus 212 what bro what are you talking about man that is what helps you out right off the bat with this website when it comes to just odds in general because it's very beneficial to be able to have access to look at all this. Now, it's just not just money line bets that they offer. When you go through here, they have all the little prop plays that they get too as well. Stolen bases, player to hit a home run. Let's just say player to hit a home run. You're interested in that. They give you the whole list of all the sports books and the best odds possible to be able to get the over under on that prop play. Like I said, that's not just for that prop play. Look at all the options that they give you. So that is why it is vital to have this access Access to see all these odds for all these different sports books guys now that's gonna take us to step two now step two is going to be having multiple sports books this is a must you need to have multiple sports books be able to access all these different lines that you need I suggest personally to do this at a high level this arbitrage betting at a high level you need to have five to seven sports books accounts at each of them and you put your bankroll split up between all of them okay like we addressed in step one you got your bankroll set up, you need to take that bankroll and you need to put it in all these sportsbook accounts that you make. It does not take long to make sports betting accounts, guys, 
So there's no excuse for that, all right? It could take you literally one day to open up five to seven sportsbook accounts and take your bankroll, spread it out because we're gonna be using all of them. So it's beneficial having access to multiple sports books. It's definitely what you have to do. All right, guys. So now we have went through step one. We assessed our bankroll. We know exactly how much money we're working with. Step two, we have made accounts with all these sports books that we need to have. And we split our bankroll up between all these sports books because you need money in each of these to be able to do this. Now we've got that set up. We're going to jump into Odds Jam and we're going to show you exactly how to look at the arbitrage betting and how to do this. It's very, very simple. All all you got to do here is you go up to betting tools you'll see arbitrage as soon as you hit that button you'll see a list of games that pop up and you will see the profit the ROI that you will get right here like this one right at the top of the board is 2.93 percent 2.66 percent this is the expected profit that's what you're gonna make on the play once you place it we're gonna do one for an example just to show you guys how easy this really is let's go ahead and do this one the Seattle Mariners against the Texas Rangers player to hit a home run Kyle Seeger over a half Kyle Seeger under a half. So remember, we're betting both sides, right? If you go over to this little calculator right here, click that calculator. It brings up exactly the odds right here. And let's just use, let's just say $100 is what we're gonna start with. So we start with 100 bucks here. That means that at these sports books, at FanDuel or PointsBet, you're gonna place this bet, Kyle Seeger over a half of a home run at up for 100 bucks at plus 270, which means you're gonna go and bet the under a half a home run at either BetMGM or BetWin at minus 250 and you're going to put 264 dollars and 29 cents they do all the math for you guys you don't got to do any math whatsoever this is you're going to be your expected profit is going to be five dollars and 71 cents now you're probably looking at that thinking oh that's nothing i'm only going to make five dollars uh, near six bucks on that you have to realize this just with small money it adds up okay let's say let's say for an example you do 10 of these bets in a day and you're making five dollars to six dollars a pop and sixty dollars a day that adds up over a whole entire month of doing this you're not sweating out the game. You're not waiting in the, in the ninth inning of a game. You're not waiting for the last second a buzzer beater to see if you hit the over or not. It does not matter. You win no matter what. It's 100% profit no matter what happens. So going back to the laptop right here, I want to show you guys. It's that simple. And we're going to take it now to those sports books. So player to hit a home run, we're doing Kyle Seeger over a half of a home run. We're going to do this at FanDuel. So let's go over to FanDuel. Then you go to, to hit a home run. Now we just find our player, Kyle Seeger, plus 270. All you gotta do is put the amount of money, you'd say 100 bucks, that's what we were, we were using as an example, to win 270 and you place that bet in. It's that simple guys. Now we go over to the other sports book. Now we are looking at the under in the Kyle Seeger. Now the under, minus 250. And now it brings it up. All you have to do is go back and refer to exactly what the calculator told you to do when you put in $100. Take this right here, highlight 264.29, Go to BetMGM, place it right there, and place your bet. It is that simple. And then once you do that, you ensure yourself a profit of $5.71 for just putting that bet in. And like I said, there's numerous ones here. As you can see, there's numerous plays that you can do throughout the entire day. Guys, this is a must thing to do because this is a 100% profit rate, all right? 100% profit. You are just putting these bets in and they tell you exactly the amount to put in. That is what you're gonna do as soon as you log in and then you have your sports books. That literally took about maybe 30 seconds to go ahead and put that arbitrage bet in and ensure that $6 return. Now, here's the thing. Now you guys know what arbitrage betting is if you didn't know already. Now you know exactly the steps you have to go through. Step one, assess your bankroll. Step two, you have to open up accounts with all these sports books so that way you ensure yourself you can make these bets because if you don't have the accounts with sports books, obviously you're not gonna be able to make the bet. Now, step three is gonna be make an account with Odds Jam and collect your money. Once you have these three steps down, you're making a profit every single day.